Hi, today I am with Rob and Mike with Green State Inspection. And um, we're at a new construction and um, they're gonna walk us through some of the key important things that um, homeowners need to be aware of. Mike and Rob, do you guys wanna say anything? Yeah, uh, this is just, uh, we're gonna show you an example of a couple of items that might convince you. If you're building a new house, um, sometimes the builders might direct you away from having a, a home inspection completed for that new house. You know, the idea is always if you buy a new car, it should be, be working fine, right? You buy a new house, there shouldn't be anything wrong with it. We find probably more deficiencies on new construction uh, inspections than we do on one and two year old houses because these are things that you would find after you bought the house, but you, you don't want to have the deficiencies that we're going to point out to you today going on in your house um, over the course of a year or two years if you just bought this new house. So, so the first one we're going to show you is up in the attic space and it has to do with the air conditioning and heating system. The point at which the, the, the supply and return ducts connect to the plenum, what's called the distribution plenum, are not sealed. And that's one of the first things I noticed when I entered this house. So we'll go up there in just a minute and you can follow us up. Hey, it's Rob back with Green State Inspection. So we wanted to show you um, one of the things that we look for in the attic space. On, on new construction homes, I always check the connections between the supply ducts and the distribution plenum. This is your distribution plenum. So this is called the air handler. The air comes in here unconditioned and goes through and get, gets conditioned. It gets filtered, heated, if it's the wintertime, and then cooled right here. So when I'm checking these, I use a, uh, a uh, directional um, thermometer. To, to take the temperature right here at the connections and also take the, the sample te temperature here on the ducts themselves and on the surface of the plenum. What we found was a 15 degree temperature leak right here at the duct connections. And I was kind of looking for that and expecting it because I didn't see any mastic here. You see this right here? This, this stuff that looks like glue right here? That's called HVAC mastic. And these, these, these ducts should be sealed with that. It's one of the first things I noticed up in the attic space. So that's something that we're gonna be reporting on the, on the inspection report today. Once the, uh, the HVAC contractor repairs that, we'll come back and re-inspect it and make sure that they, they did it correctly.